Hey guys, this tutorial is brought to you by uh, the Animation Base, and we are going to be looking at some cool things that you can do with the Touch Tool in Flash CS4. So, uh, go ahead and create a new document. As you can see, I'm using Action Script 3. It doesn't really matter what you use. Um, you want to select the Touch Tool, uh, write whatever you want to. I'll put the Animation Base. Uh, we'll change it to black and we will make it a little bit bigger and also we will change the font to something kind of cool hmm we'll use comic sans so okay once you have that done uh, you can also change the background color to whatever you want. I'm going to keep mine uh, white. So, with your text selected, you want to hit a Command B, and that is for uh, Mac users. For Windows users, it's just going to be a Control B, and you will see that it has uh, broke up the text into different parts so each letter is its own kind of not symbol but just um its own object and so if you select all that again and click command B or control B whether whatever you want PC or Mac you will see that now it has become just uh, really customizable because you can now you have all the uh, different things that you can do when you make a line, like bend the text or do some crazy things with it. So, okay, what we're going to be doing is I'm going to show you how to make a kind of cool effect that doesn't take too long. So, with all the selected, you want to put Command or Control C to copy it. And then make sure you don't have that clicked anymore, selected. You want to click Command or Control V. Let's change the color to a, let's see, we'll change it to a red. Then you want to Command or Control X, which will cut the, uh, cut the text that you just made. Click New Layer on this layer. Click Command or Control V, whatever you're on. So now you have two separate layers. So let's put Test 1, Test 2. Okay, so with Test 2, you want to take what you just uh, pasted on the stage and put it right where your other test is and move it over a little bit. I'm using the uh, keys, move it up a little bit. And as you can see, it's created kind of cool drop shadow for you. So, also with this, um, you can do some pretty cool stuff with it. Uh, let's see here. Go back to your text one, and you are going to want to. Here, there we go. You're going to want to convert this to a symbol and we'll call it text one and make sure that it is a movie clip and click OK. Come over to the uh, filters property, click this, add a new glow and uh, make the glow, we'll say about that and a lighter red or orangey actually, just like that and then you want to click Nacho. Now now we will change the stage to uh, black, and as you can see, it's created kind of cool, cool kind of text. You can play around with it. You can also change the color of the top text, or you can switch the uh, filter to a inner glow, or you can just have it normal. You can change the glow color to whatever you want, which make it look kind of neat. And uh, so yeah, that's how you can create some cool different 
text effects and hope you guys like the uh, tutorial make sure you comment and subscribe and thanks for watching